Hi, I'm Katie Bell with the IMC. I'm here today at Bossler at Williamsport Pattern Works to learn a little bit about their business. We're here with Lou Bossler, owner of the company, and Aaron Bossler, project navigator at the company. We started in 1971 making architectural and industrial scale models, and it's evolved into uh, quite, a, quite an array of, of projects. Locally in Pennsylvania, we have ShopVac Corporation, who we've been dealing with for more than 30 years. Uh, Textron Light Cumming aircraft engines. We do a lot of uh, patterns for amusement rides for companies such as Disney, Universal Studios, all the major amusement parks. We recently bought a new Fortis 400 machine, a rapid prototyping technology. Uh, we've been involved in rapid prototyping uh, for a number of years, for well over 10 years. We were the first one in the state of Pennsylvania to have a LOM machine, which is laminated object manufacturing, building parts layer by layer out of paper. This new machine uh, that we purchased, uh, the Fortis 400 and the Dimension machine, both build parts out of ABS plastic. Well, we work with our clients to develop new products, designing, designing in three dimensions, basically utilizing a 3D solid modeling program or software. It's my job to actually get that into a format that's understood universally by anybody who's in the mold making business, who can operate rapid prototyping machinery or anything like that. Uh, to get the physical part in that client's hands requires their ideas to be put into the computer. Minor changes like whole uh, change to a, to a piece of hardware or a hole size that needs to be put in a part. Uh, oftentimes in, in the traditional methods of making a prototype or making a pattern, that would be very time consuming. It can be a, a couple of very simple clicks nowadays. The CNC router is uh, a pretty unique piece of equipment. It's, it's common to the industry. Uh, a lot of companies have them. Ours is a three-axis CNC router. It has a five foot by five foot bed and a, uh, about a 20 inch vertical dimension of clearance. We do an awful lot of patterns for the amusement industry using that router. The, the, the neat thing about this, the CNC router is we can take anyone's three-dimensional files and again translate them through Mastercam right into the router and reproduce exactly what has been designed. Rotocasting is very similar to roto uh, molding. Roto molding is a hot process. Rotocasting is you mix two urethanes together, two parts of the urethane together, and they create their own exothermic kick and become a uh, solid part. So rotocasting makes a hollow part very quickly, actually. Um, and what you need is, is an original pattern. Then you make a mold, either a, a rubber mold, an RTV mold, or uh, a hard mold of some type that you can get your part out of. All of our technologies that we're using in our shop, like the CNC router, rapid prototyping, and uh, that is all geared towards that very end, giving the client what they really want. Thank you, Lou. Thank you, Aaron, for your time. We know you're really busy here. Thank you for showing us a lot of the things you make here. You do some really cool things. A lot of fun things. Yep. So to learn more about Bossler, please sign up for their email list below or visit their website at bosslerwpw.com. Before I leave, I want to show you the seat that I'm sitting on because it's a seat that they made with their rotocasting equipment. Looks like an ice cream cone. Great for an ice cream shop, so that's what I was able to sit on today. Cool.
Thanks.